Boys and girls, welcome to the new Apex Legends mobile update called After Show, where we have new map updates, new rank changes, a brand new battle pass, and a new mode. Solo mode, baby. What's going on, guys? My name's Rose. Welcome back to another video. So Apex Legends Mobile tweeted out recently their brand new patch notes for us for the new season after show. Well, new season is kind of a mid-season update. It's season 2.75, and then we've got season 3 in a couple of weeks. But oh my god, did they deliver in this mid-season update. So starting off, when is it coming? The new season after show is dropping on October 5th at 12 a.m. UTC, where in the UK, that is 1 a.m. So we'll work your way around those time zones. Now it looks like we have a brand new battle pass with some amazing cosmetics up for grabs for an incredible price. So you can unlock the after show battle pass for just 299 syndicate gold. And this is obviously shorter than usual, but as they say, it is still packed with awesome rewards. And you can see right there, we've got a brand new purple rain Loba skin. It actually says below that premium level 20. So it looks like this battle pass will probably just be 20 levels instead of the standard 50. You can also see a flatline golden skin right there and that looks like it's on the level one premium as soon as you unlock it and it looks as well that you can also get some free syndicate gold by just unlocking it as well so you probably get some refunded back and then staying on the battle pass topic you can also see it ends on the 19th of october so that could mean season three which is what i predicted we're gonna have this season for a couple of weeks with a short battle pass and some new little updates in the game and then we're gonna have season three around the 19th of october and it looks like we have the secure date right now so let's go we're also going to be getting some brand new map changes as well beginning on october 12th the team will be making some slight changes to king's canyon the uncle galore ship and the pytas theater will be leaving the map for now this will impact both ranked and normal battle royale but it's as i predicted guys that leak that was going around looks like a brand new sort of stage or some sort of arena being built into the game so the pytas arena and the uncle galore are going to be gone and we're going to get this brand new sort of stadium in the middle of uh, king's canyon so no world's edge yet but hopefully we're gonna get that in season three now jesus they just shocked everyone with this one this has been a huge thing for the mobile community okay is adding a solo mode we've all been through the pain guys of having absolute dog trash teammates and now you don't even need to worry about that because we're gonna have solo battle royale mode it says here get ready for the ultimate solo challenge no teammates just you and a map full of enemies fighting to be the apex champion now let's go over that it says solo battle royale so it's probably not going to be ranked it's going to be a normal battle royale mode which means you can't get your rank ups by doing it so it's going to be similar to you know first person and third person battle royale mode but there's going to be a solos in there as well there's no indicator that there's going to be duos or maybe they're going to get rid of trios altogether and it'll just be solos for the next two weeks in normal battle royale mode who knows but hit a like and let me know what you think in the comments of this update so far because we've got even more guys we've also got some brand new rank changes you can complete missions on selected weekends to earn rank protection cards that will basically keep you and protect you from losing points during a match should you or your teammates run into any unlucky circumstances so on october 8th to the 10th and october 15th to the 17th you can play ranked matches and get these ranked protection cards and basically let's say i'm a diamond one if i actually got hot drop into the game and i get wiped out straight away then i could potentially drop to diamond two but with one of these rank protection cards that will keep me in diamond one so i kind of like that idea the only downside is obviously the people that are grinding for the leaderboards it's going to be a bit harder and a bit longer for them to grind up because obviously everyone's going to be rank protected but i think what they're doing by putting them on these specific dates it's just they're testing it they're testing the waters seeing what it's like but let me know what you guys think in the comments and if you guys prefer it or not and then on top of that it says here play with your friends up until platinum they have removed any ranked restrictions for who you can party up with. So before, if you're Platinum, you couldn't party up with one of your Bronze team members that has just joined the game to play with you. But now, from Platinum or below, anyone can join anyone's lobby. They haven't mentioned anything above, so I don't know if that means, you know, the Predators are going to be able to play with, you know, Diamond 5s or not, but we'll have to wait and see for the update. Now, usually on these patch notes, there is also some extra sort of info on, like, your bugs and reports and stuff. Doesn't look like there's anything on this, and that probably means that there's not going to be any sort of optimization or any bug fixes this season or this mid season update. But don't worry, again, guys, we've only got two weeks until season three, and 
I've been speaking to the devs and they've got some big, big changes coming. So that's going to, you know, probably include a lot more optimization for the low to mid-end devices, a lot more good stuff for you guys. So you'll be able to play the game a lot smoother. Same as me, I'll be able to play the game a lot smoother. Obviously, there's some things that, you know, the community still want in the game, like jump spam being removed and nerfed and, and all different things like that probably going to come in season three guys okay this update is simply just a little update just to keep us going until season three i think it's actually really good that the developers have added in a mid-season update instead of us you know playing the same stuff for another two weeks until season three so you got to give it to them guys all you guys that are being negative about the game change that into some positivity man they're literally giving us some cool new things and solo mode is what we've been asking for for a long long time in the game so i'm excited i hope you guys are excited as well if you are make sure you hit a like subscribe i'm going to be live streaming the event tomorrow when the actual update comes out so i'll do some viewer games we can check out solo mode together but again guys that's it so get excited it's a little update for us just to keep us going until season three where the big changes will come so thank you for watching check out this gameplay Literally best gun in the game. Prowler is just disgusting. one guy Nice little double on that loba. Let's go. <laughs> Shoo. Um, nice game.